Good morning, everybody. This is C7, the HOA homesteader. Today, I'm treating my bees for varibites. It's a four week process. I started last week. I didn't capture it on uh, video, so I thought I'd do so today. With that said, I got a, uh, I use a bug defogger. My propane tank just attaches right here. Screw it in. Turn this knob here, a quarter of a turn. Let the gas start flowing through, light it with a lighter. Wait a couple of minutes and it'll be ready to go. What I'm using to, to treat the bees with is mineral oil. And I know that there's a better and more lethal chemicals out there that you could use like oxalic acid, but I was afraid to use it. So they say this is like a 50, 60% success rate I only have one high so I chose to go the safer route but in doing so I still I'm still using a respirator when I when I treat them so only two things is uh, in this jar down here and that's uh, mineral oil and a couple of drops of, of thigh but with that said that's what I'm gonna do today far as treating my bees in the, in the garden. You can see my rain barrels in the, in the background. They need to be uh, cleaned annually and it's that time of year I need to clean them. I'm not sure if I'm gonna put that on tape or not, but that's stuff that I gotta do around here today. It's always something need to be done when you're trying to uh, stay prepared. With that said, guys, I thank you guys in advance for visiting my channel. You guys have been with C70HOA Homesteader. And let's capture a little bit of uh, footage of me shooting the bees. See ya. All right, I'm just gonna hit them with a little four second blast and that's it. Ain't really nothing much to it, but uh, I started my first installment of this treatment for veramites last week and i didn't capture it on film so i'm not gonna do all uh, four weeks i gotta do four weeks in a row so i just thought i'd capture what i'm doing today and bring you guys along with me Okay, everybody, y'all saw how simple that was. Just ran out there after I got dressed and prepared, shot the bees for about a four second blast of the solution, and that was all to it. So I got uh, two more weeks to do it. And then uh, after that, I guess I'll do another alcohol wash and see uh, how effective I was. But I wanted to treat them before the month of March gets around because down here in the zone, 10A is going to already start getting hot and the bees are really going to start foraging again. So before they start bringing that nectar in and honey in, making honey, I wanted to get them treated. And with that said, guys, that's it for today. You guys have been with C7, the HOA homesteader. And you know what the motto is. Just because you may live in HOA doesn't mean that you cannot grow food or take care of bees. Thank you for visiting the channel, and I hope to see you again soon.